Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you how to install Oracle Database Agency XE on Windows. First, go and download the Oracle installer zip file and then extract it into a new folder like here. Then head into the folder and look for setup.exe file and double click on it. Click yes when Windows asks you if you want to execute the file. That will bring up the installer for you. First it will install the prerequisites for XE. This may take a while. When all the prerequisites have been installed, it will bring up the actual installer. First hit next. Accept the license agreement. On the next screen, you can choose the install path of Oracle Database Agency Express Edition. You don't have to change it, you can just hit next, or if you want to, you can hit the change button and change it to the location you desire. Last, specify the password for the SUS system and PDB admin accounts, and confirm it and hit next. On the last screen, you will see the destination once more, just to confirm, once you're happy, click install. Now the Oracle database is being installed. This may take a while, depending on the speed of your computer. We have speeded up here, so that you don't have to wait. If you have the Windows Defender Firewall enabled, throughout the installation it will ask you whether you want to block or allow traffic for the Java platform that comes with the Oracle database installed. Click allow access and the installation will proceed. Once again, we have speed up here the installation process in this video. And that's it. Oracle Database 18C XE is now installed. You will see the connect information of how to connect to the CDB as well as the pluggable database and EM Express in your browser. Click finish. Now let's connect. Open up a command prompt. And then just type SQL plus slash SysDBA. We are now connected to the container database of Oracle Database 18C. Let's check the banner from the V$ version view. And here we go. Now Oracle Database 18C comes with the container database architecture. That means that there is a PDB ready for you to go and you will have to connect to the PDB in order for your data to be stored. If you have forgotten the name, you can always look in the V$ PDB view. Here we go. Let's select the name at the open mode from the V$PDB view. And you will see there is one PDB in there called XEPDB1 and it's open for read and write. Now you're good to go. Have fun with Oracle Database 18C Express Edition on Windows and thanks for watching.